I am Dr. Deval Pramanik, Assistant Professor of NVIST, Kolkata. Today, I will be addressing the transportation problem as part of the operation research course. It is a variant of linear programming problem where goods are moved from a group of destinations based on the supply and demand of sources and destinations with the goal of minimizing the overall transportation cost. Basically, there are two distinct categories of transportation problems. First of all is, already I have discussed in my another video, balanced transportation problem where supply is equal to demand and unbalanced transportation problem where supply is not equal to demand. Within these two broad kinds of transportation problem, there are three methods to tackle them. First of all is Northwest Corner Cell Method, already I have discussed in my previous lecture. Next one is East Coast Cell Method and another one is Vogel's Approximation Method or HAM Method. Today, we will focus on the application of the least corner cell method. Prior to the comprehension, I will address a specific issue pertaining to the least cost cell technique. So, this is our transportation problem. Here, we can see there are three origins and to send the product or goods, that is the cost. Three rupees, one rupees, seven rupees, four rupees, two rupees, six rupees, five rupees, nine rupees. These are the transportation cost and these is our goods where demand is specified and supply is also specified. Now we check, now this is, now we check this is my, this is my balanced transportation problem or unbalanced problem transportation problem. You can see that is 300, 400 and 500 is equal to 1200 and now this is 250, 350, 400 and 200 that is 1200. So this is your balanced transportation problem and now we are solved here that is the least cost corner cell method. Now we check from this table where the cost of the transportation is minimized that is here we can see that 1 rupees is the minimized transportation cost. So first you block this. Now we can see there is a 350 demand and 300 supply. So we put here 300. So this is 0 and this is your 50. Remaining is 50. Now we can delete this box. Now search where the transportation cost is minimized. So we can see there are two allocated cells where the transportation cost is minimum. That is two here and here also two. You can take any one of them. First I take this two. So see this is 200 and this is 500. Put here 200. So this is your zero and remaining is 300. So this is your deleted cell. Now next minimum value that is again the 2. Now block this cell and you can see this is 250 and this is 400. Now we can get 250. This is 0 and remaining is 150. Now cross this cell. Next remaining cell. Next again there are two block card room that is 3 and 3 right so you can take again any of cell this is 3 this is 300 this is 0 and this is 100 so you can give this now next this is 5 list of 100 and this is the remaining 50. So this is the deleted part. Now next is 6. This is 50, 0 and this is 50, 0. So this is the balance transportation cost. Now the 
result is the result is 300 into 1 plus 250 into 2 plus 50 into 6 plus 100 into 5 